Which black Africans have the most non-African DNA? I bet you didn't know this. At number five, we have East African groups such as Maasai, Tutsis, and the largest ethnicity of Kenya, the Kikuyus. These groups have between 10 and 25% of West Eurasian admixture that they received indirectly from mixing with Kushites. At number four, we have the Fulanis of West Africa. Fulanis notably have North African admixture through which some Fulani groups inherited between 20 to 30% of West Eurasian admixture. Although other groups of Fulani can have as little as five or 10%. We have to go all the way east for number three to the island of Madagascar. Here the Malagasy people are unique because their non-African admixture isn't West Eurasian, but Southeast Asian. They received this admixture and their language from Austronesian sailors that settled Madagascar. Malagasy's average around 35% of Southeast Asian admixture. The second place goes to the Cushitic people of the Horn of Africa, such as Somalis, Oromos, and Afars. They average anywhere between 30 and 50% of West Eurasian admixture, which they received more than 10,000 years ago from the Natufians. Finally, the people of Sub-Saharan Africa with the most non-African DNA are the Semitic-speaking Habeshas of Ethiopia and Eritrea. On top of having a Cushitic genetic foundation, they also received additional Middle Eastern gene flow around the time of the Sabaean Kingdom. They often average between 50 and 60% of West